welcome back to my channel. I'm Pixcake, and today I have something to share with you. So I haven't been. First of all, let me tell you why I haven't been posting lately. I've been ill for the past week, and just uh, I've been that ill that I can't. I could uh, basically I couldn't talk because of all the phlegm and stuff that was in my throat and um, that's why I couldn't upload and then Race got ill and I was looking after him for a week so we've both been just really really sick which is why I haven't uploaded anything um, so what I wanted to share with you guys is and there's going to be loads of videos uploaded soon about it but what I wanted to share with you guys is the new member of our family um, and this is Tessa she is only six weeks old she's gorgeous oh, she, she's gorgeous um, she's, she was really skeptical uh, skeptical about coming into the house uh, who can blame her I've got five dogs um, so, and she'd never seen a dog because the owner that had her hadn't got any dogs. And let's face it, coming into a house where that's five dogs, she's going to be really scared. Um, so, basically, I'm going to be sharing with you guys on how she's growing up. Um, because of where she's only six weeks old... Like, they're not meant to even leave their mums until they're eight weeks old. So, I just thought it was a good, op not a good opportunity, but, well, kind of a good opportunity to share with you guys how she grows up and, um, basically how she gets on because she's been literally taken away from her mother, basically, uh, because the owner didn't want her. But um, I know that you can wean them off of your, their mother at six weeks anyway, which is what we're kind of trying to do because we're giving her kitten meat and um, cat milk. But we're trying to wean her off the milk so that um, basically she doesn't have to feel the constant need to um, want to suckle. Because she does, uh, I've been sitting there um, and she will just come up to me and start like kneading on my, on my neck which is why I've got these here and that and basically she will try and suckle on me, um, I've had it where she's tried suckling on my sister's ear, uh, like on this part, oh sorry Tess, and um, so we've had to kind of give her her milk and basically it's not she she's getting there she's really good and she she's best friends with um one of my dogs called Difa she's laying down over there at the minute but um basically um I just wanted to share with you guys on how she how she does and um I accidentally hit the stop record button. Um, I just want to show you guys on how she does and how she gets on and how she grows up and how she gets on with the dogs. Um, and basically just share with you guys on how she is progressing from being away from her mum so early and how she looks and ends up growing into a beautiful girl that's gonna be an adult and let me just try and pick her up um i know come here there we go yeah you got up there but um basically uh i just really really i, I love cats i love dogs obviously i've got five uh I love any form of animals and I kind of want that to be, uh, obviously I want gaming, 
and I'm not saying I don't I'm I'm not saying I'm cutting gaming out but I really 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 do want my channel to be about uh gaming uh animals because and I was watching my friend's channel uh yesterday and she was saying how she keeps getting asked for subs for subs and stuff and that's not how we want to do it and if we like your footage and we want to see more then we, yeah we'll subscribe but um, we feel like it's cheating and um, I totally agree with her it is kind of like cheating and I I won't do that unless I really want to see the rest of your footage and um, I like something um, that's on your channel like because I, I believe that and unless you like my footage I'm not saying that you don't like my footage but um I don't have all the editing gear I don't I don't know how to edit to save my life I've only just figured out how to uh put my videos together with my introduction and like all my videos and the music sometimes um and it's taken a while and I'm still getting used to recording games on the PlayStation 4 when I'm at races and it's so much it's like it is a lot of work and I can understand where everybody comes from now but um on the on the YouTube when they've got so many viewers and like if you don't post straight away people can get really really angry and Obviously, I don't have that on my channel because I've only got 35 subscribers, but it's so crazy. But basically, I want my videos to be about animals, about gaming, basically things that I like doing. Like, um, soon I'll be doing normal daily, not kind of daily vlogs because that's a lot. But every now and again, I'll do a vlog. Every now and again, I'll upload videos. Um about Tessa because that's a strong part of my channel and she's asleep but um a strong part of my channel is gonna be about my pets like Stuart and Rodney they're gerbils I've got two gerbils upstairs um I've got five dogs and I've got Tessa now which is a lot of work but do you know what she really needed a good home uh, she, we didn't have to pay for her, the only promise that we made to the woman that gave her to us was that we'd get her spayed when she's old enough, um, because that's one of the promises that we made, just, I think it's so it doesn't turn around to, like, get her, because, uh, she can obviously have kittens, and she obviously doesn't want us selling off, um, cat, like, cats and getting money for it. Because obviously she might think that's not right. But um, like giving a normal cat to a, a, a good home like here um, is so good. I want to be one of them people, like my, my friend said, um, Adele, uh, which is Blue Bear. She, um, she wants to be doing charity videos sorry <clears throat> she wants to start doing charity videos eventually like me um i want to be doing uh charity videos for raising money for cancer for raising money for um animals for um cancer research and stuff okay sorry uh, my mum just rang me um so as I was saying, I want to be doing eventually videos where I can um, basically help um, raise money for different kinds of charities. Um, and I'm not going to end up sticking to like one charity. Like I know that there could be a few out there where they'd stick to cancer or they'd stick to animals. I will vary between different kinds of things like children in need and uh, things like that um, and I basically really 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 love working with animals 
I love working and doing gaming videos. I love adventuring and uh, doing like uh, going on an adventure and just doing different things that will interest you guys and basically with Tessa um, because obviously she's been taken away from her mum at such a young age and six weeks is so so young so I kind of really 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 want to um, do progress videos about her she's so sleepy and um, basically, I know that everybody loves cats and dogs and I'm not doing it for the subscribers. That's not what I'm all about. I'm doing it to basically show you guys that even though their uh, original owners didn't want her, then taking her and putting her into a good home, like rehoming her into a better home is a good thing and basically not all people want to just have uh, their cat or their dog or even hamsters, gerbils and any other animal and just rehome them because they don't want them, they don't need them but which is why I've got five dogs because basically we liked three of the pups that um, the mum and the dad had pups with. So they had pups, we kept three of the pups back. One, two from the first litter, one from the second. It would have been two but we found uh, Rudy another home which was quite sad because I got his collar and I've got his bowl and then we got one person phone up going we're still looking for a dog like do you still have any pups left and my dad turned around going yes because obviously five dogs is a lot to handle like we like going on camp outs and basically um going on camp outs with my family and it's really difficult to find one that will take on five dogs, especially because we're such a big family. So that's five people plus five dogs, and sometimes you have to pay for the dogs um, and pay for the camping spots with the with per car. And we all we we can get all the dogs in one car. We're not saying that we can't, but obviously when we go camping, we have like someone here at home and if they're if someone's here at home then all the dogs will stay at home anyway because it's a good relief to like not have to keep taking the dogs with you all the time and making sure we've got the dog food making sure we've got their bowls their leads their collars and not having to like worry about if another dog's coming over to start an argument because that's like another thing where uh, you can take your animals and it will end up causing arguments with another dog and because their dog isn't like if it's been bit in the past like Maggie because she got bit in the past by um, a dog I think it was a German no it was, I don't think it was a German Shepherd I don't know what it was I, I, I feel like it might have been a staff but Staffs aren't horrible. They get told that they're horrible animals, like, um, but that they're really not horrible animals. Uh, my friend's got a dog that's a staff, and she's a lunatic. She's not horrible. She's really nice. All she wants to do is play and have fun. She'll nip at your face, but she won't be horrible. And I think staffs get that name of a horrible animal like a nasty animal because so many people used them for dog fights and things like that and it's just given them a really horrible name um so 
I kind of want to stop like dog fights as well because that still goes on. I I see like videos on Facebook and stuff with dog fights, and at the end you will have one of them that's got a. Uh, their side ripped out or a chunk missing out of them because the other dog's bitten them and literally yanked a chunk of meat out of them. Um, but as for people that want to scrub... Words are not my thing today, apparently. As for people that want to subscribe to me, subscribe if you like my footage. Don't subscribe if it's a sub-for-sub -sub thing, for crying out loud, because... I feel like it's cheating if I don't like your footage if, if I like your footage but I don't feel like there's anything more for me to um, watch because it interests me and you're doing good and I know for a fact you'll be doing good because everyone starts out rough I started out really rough on my channel because I was just doing vlogs I done the Coca-Cola lorry I done children's in need and I've done that sort of thing and I'm trying to do bath hauls and stuff like that um, but it's really difficult because I've just got a job and I haven't had my first pay yet so I can't get loads of different things in to do uh, different videos and keep you guys interested because my channel isn't really doing a lot right now but it will when I get some money in and I'll end up doing different things like I'll be going um, out for meals and stuff and I'll be taking you guys with me because obviously I'll be doing more vlogs and different basically I'm gonna be doing loads of different things and I want to keep you guys interested I want to keep you guys happy with uh, my channel make other people happy and want to come join us which speaking of which is you have people um like coming on hey gorgeous coming onto my channel and um basically being really like rude kind of um like i had uh, a comment a, f a few months back which was really disturbing and it's not something that I want on my channels which is why being nice to people goes a really really long way like supporting a channel and helping another person like if you want that help um, and have a shout out then I'll give you a shout out and because I'm not going to be, I won't sit there and I won't not give you, help you proceed to fulfil your YouTube dreams or um, stop you from having that dream that you want. Because if you want um, a subscribers, then I'll give you a shout out. But if I don't feel like your footage will keep me like if there's nothing specific that I really really want to watch then I won't subscribe but I know that your footage will be good and I know that I keep repeating myself but I, I don't know how much more I can express um, how I, I feel about sub for subs because I know exactly what my friend was talking about in her YouTube video um, for sub for sub sort of things and it's not I don't want to say it's not fair on the people that you that uh, you ask because I understand why you're doing it but at the same time it's a lot of pressure on us because we feel like it's cheating but obviously you feel like that we hate you or don't like you. Hate's a really strong word. But if you if you think that we don't like you or we don't like your footage, it's not that. We think that your footage is good. But if there's nothing there that keeps us person ooh, personally interested, sorry, then we won't subs we're not gonna subscribe to you because basically 
it's something if it, if there's nothing there to really grab a hold of our attention and if there's nothing there that keeps us interested not saying that your channel's not interesting because it might be interesting to other people but it's i don't know it's a lot of it's a lot to to take on and um basically you know with that sort of thing um it's 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 really really like it would be great it would be great to hit 100 subscribers that that is my goal currently to hit 100 subscribers or even 50 subscribers because 50 to me that's a lot 35 is a lot but 50 or 100 that is my goal to to get either 50 or 100 subscribers and I'm not saying that because of oh she just wants fame I don't want the fame it's not the fame right Let, let's get that out of the way because sometimes people think oh they're doing this for the fame they're doing it for the for the 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 uh, attention we're not doing it for that basically we want to do this to put smiles on other people make them happy and basically just make someone's day better but it is so so difficult because we have to make sure we've got the money we have to keep make sure that we've got um um a lot of things to keep people interested like gaming videos like baffles like animals like because if you want to go in that general direction then animals and stuff and i know she can see my hand right now um animals and things like that it's a difficult route to go down but i think if people like your footage and they want to see more and see how they grow up then they should if if they're interested in that channel then yeah subscribe but with where i'm going with what i'm saying is with the animals and the videos i'm going to be making like vlogs and i, I keep repeating myself but it's so that it sinks in kind of thing but my channel isn't going to be based around gaming it's going to be various of different things and it's going to be loads loads so many different things are going to be on my channel when i get more money in and hopefully i'll be starting like an as seen on tv sort of thing like i've got some hair chalks and I, I've like dyed my hair a bit blonder so that you can not for this that specifically but I've dyed it a bit blonder and hopefully it'll come out um, a lot more better like that's, that was so wrongly worded but so that it'll come out on my head like the hair chalk will come out more vibrant on my hair and I'm gonna be dyeing my hair soon um after i've done the hair chalk one and i'll basically be um doing hopefully an as seen on tv series if i don't then i'll end up doing something else uh, if i can think of something else i'll do something else but for time being there's a lot of stuff that I want to be doing and um, it's it's a lot to try and work around and I know that I've been ranting for almost like half an hour but you guys haven't really heard anything from me um, in a, a few weeks because I've been ill and then race has been ill um, he races still ill but he's at home and basically 
we just want to i for my channel i just really really want to push myself because i don't it's very rare that i push myself to do anything it's very rare like with my drums if you want to see me do some drum videos i i'll admit i'm not the best but i'm still learning myself and i don't know what happened with me and my drums but i just decided i'm not going to do them no more um at the time there was a lot of stuff going on um and it was i just met race and uh basically got with race but before i got with race a load of stuff happened so it was about a year and a month ago plus that i'd stopped playing my drums and i've just kind of tried to get back into them like i'll occasionally sit there tapping on my legs and um that's one thing but then something else is getting the drums out playing them getting good at them my my dad made me carbon fiber drumsticks and i don't touch them because of loads of other stuff that happened which is like my my family we have a lot of dreams my dad wants to make his own guitars and sell his own guitars and start his own business that's me and he he's still making bits for guitars and for things like that like i do painting in my spare time my sister wants to be an artist but for things like gu guitars and stuff um like he, he collects guitars like let me let me show you guys some but let me show you guys um a few things that my dad's been making lately and it's this and there's um a roger not a, it might be a roger rabbit roger rabbit thing um the girl with the red hair let me show you guys there you go and he'll basically do that sort of thing and he made a ukulele uh which is called the gofalele because it looks like a coffin and sort of i don't know i can't get the right lighting it's like that and he's gonna make it a coffin to go in as well because obviously gofalele sort of thing and then my sister has recently started her own business um as glitz and glam and she's made all the cards to give out to get her name out there her come like court sort of company name out and she's made pens she's made she's gonna be making shirts soon and basically what she does is not it's not permanent it's, it's a still something that's still building up and trying to you know like work she'll be doing weddings she'll be doing halloween uh so theatrical makeup um she works with stuff like latex and body paint and loads of crazy stuff and her stuff that she does is really good i can't personally like paint on a body i'm really really bad at face paint or body paint or anything from that form but makeup i'm okay not because not being really big headed or anything but i've done hair and beauty and done my makeup and blah 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 but sorry i know that this keeps happening um but still to this day oh, i don't even remember what i was saying now still to this day she's i feel like i was talking about my sister um she's nope i know what i was talking about again i'm sorry i'm really ditzy if something distracts me and then i'll go on and talk about um something else 
Um, and I'll f totally blank and I'll forget everything. So basically, um, I done hair and beauty. I done my makeup, but still to this day, I don't understand how to use bronzer. I'll end up like looking into it if I really need it, but I don't really need it. I don't really like, like it's bad enough with my foundation that I've got on now, um, and lipstick. But if I don't put lipstick on, then my lips look like they're not there. Um, then basically, like what I'm trying to say is, everybody has goals. I don't know what my mum's is, but everybody has goals and my boyfriend's goal is to oh my god i don't actually know what his is but race's goal i i feel like his goal is to get a job get money move out proceed with life <laughs> but and then obviously family blah 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 etc etc and then whatever else happens in between. My goal is hobbies and making sure that I live my life to what it's meant to be. If I like doing something, then I should do it. If I don't like doing something, then I don't do it. Then, it, it, like, it's just really, really difficult because with things like that, you can't always go around it. You can't always do what you want to do. Like, some people want to have a job where they work on YouTube. Now, if you was to sit at home working on YouTube, like what I am not trying to do, but if I was to work on you, if I was to work with YouTube and get that many views and that many subscribers and blah 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 to the point where YouTube became my job then it would be really really cool and really really different but at the same time really I don't know like kind of draining because of all the videos and you'd have to stay up late and upload them and sometimes uploading can take forever and I know this because the first video that I ever uploaded took a good hour and a, or two hours and I went out to the shops and went out with my friends while that was uploading and came back and it still wasn't uploaded it had like half an hour left but um now I'm using my phone to upload and it comes uploads like that and basically that's the sort of thing that I need but it's really difficult to think of ideas so what I'm trying to say is now if you guys have any suggestions at all on what I should do then please 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 put in the comments below what you want to see me do what um, videos and sort of things that you want to see me do whether I should go out whether I should do vlogs whether i should do more videos of the dogs because you, you don't you guys haven't even met all the dogs you'll see them in clips and videos but you you haven't met them you've got um the ger if you want to see more videos of the gerbils to see how they're getting on then sure um i'll do that more gaming videos which, if that's the case, then I'll buy a PlayStation for myself or an Xbox One. I don't know. I can't decide yet. But either way, it has to have some form of recording on it. Because I don't want to get a PVR or a DPVR or whatever it is. Because then you have to get a new TV and you have to make sure it's got all the plug sockets in it. And I don't have time for that. I just need something that's straightforward. Um... And quick and easy to do until it gets into more complication than in the further future when I have a few more subscribers if I get a few more subscribers but please 
leave in the comments below suggestions on videos that you guys really want to see because it does help us out a lot it helps out any new youtuber and i say i'm new i'm not that new but i still feel like i'm new because it, i haven't been making videos very often and i'm still edgy around what to say and what to do and um basically on how to approach everybody because even though off camera I'm, I'm myself and everything but I want to be able to come out on my shell more and show you guys who I really am not saying that you're not seeing who I really am now but I want to be able to show you not show you guys how weird I am but I am really really weird and 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 kind of energetic depending on the day and if it's miserable and raining outside like it is today don't like it no um but when it's hot and when it's sunny outside and when I'm in a really good mood or uh I'm out with race or I don't know something like going shopping like if you want to do a follow me vlog like basically where I take you guys with me when I'm uh, buying stuff for other videos obviously I won't show you what's in that video I won't show you what I'm buying and I won't tell you what I'm buying but I will take you with me and I will talk about other stuff sorry but that's kind of all I really really wanted to say and I know that this video is going to go on for ages and ages and ages and it has been going on for ages and ages because I haven't just I haven't shut up um but I feel like I kind of needed to have a bit of a a say to everything that was on my mind and I can't because Basically, I was watching her video and I understood exactly everything that she was saying about how she felt and how she um, approaches everything. And I totally agree with her on what she's saying. And I just felt like I had to address that on my channel as well because some people won't understand that. They, they won't like they'll just be like really rude and um they might think that we don't like them or we don't like their channel or we don't like their footage um so I just felt like I had to address that because I'm not horrible I can be sometimes but I wouldn't be to people online because I've grown up now I'm mature I'm not an absolute boob we'll go with that yeah we'll go with that I'm not an absolute boob because it's just not needed to put silly comments anymore it's not needed to basically sit there and say sub for sub like I'll check out your channel I'm not saying that I won't and I'm not saying that your stuff's bad or anything on your channel for me not to subscribe but I just felt like I had to get that off my chest and I know that I keep repeating myself but I can't address it anymore because I feel very um heartfelt I think that's the right words I, I struggle with words basically um but when it comes to talking about certain things and I'm very heartfelt I feel like that's the right word but um that about this sort of thing so I just kind of had to get it off my chest and get it out there and just say what I think because there's a lot of stuff that I want for my channel and um she's twitching let me try and get her I know, I'm sorry, I keep waking you. And, um, 
There you go. And, um, but yeah, so, if you want to see more on my channel, then put in the comments below what sort of things you want to see on my channel. Like, whether it's, um, makeup video, like, a makeup video, a proper one, because I know that a few people will like that sort of thing and if even if it's just a basic look like what I'm wearing now um then sure if, if it's something to do with clothes or dresses or prom because obviously prom's just been I've got my prom dress upstairs um and it's pretty difficult to get in by myself but um basically there's just a lot that I want to do with my channel. So, comments below. Co comments below. There we go. Uh, on what you want to see me do with my channel. I'm giving you the free will right now to tell me what you want. Don't sit there and watch this video. And not put a comment on just one thing. One comment. On this video so that you guys can give me that lead if, if every if every person was to comment and give me that little lead on what I should do with this channel then that would be such a big help but anyway carrying on with what I was saying like this video, comment on this video if you want to see me do other stuff on this channel and basically subscribe if you really really like my videos, um, like, thumbs up, share, like really put yourself out there and if you don't like this video and you don't agree with what I said then totally fine don't disagree with you everybody has their own point of views but like comment share and subscribe if you want to see more videos i hope you guys don't think i was ranting too much obviously this is a really long video and it was meant to be just introducing tessa um, which she's asleep right now, cuddled into my neck. Um, but basically, yeah, yeah, you want cuddles. Um, but yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and just be nice to people is all I'm saying because niceness goes a long way, it really, really does. Um, and comment below please because it will really help me out but again sorry for being ill lately um, and not uploading anything but um, yeah all I can say is look forward to the weekend uh, this weekend and next weekend because I'll be putting a new Minecraft video up Mortal Kombat will be up and oh i'm sorry i woke you didn't i oh thank you for the kisses you're so cute oh. yeah um but yeah so oh, you're so cute <laughs> there'll be a lot of videos of tessa going up really shortly there's a flipgram there's a few <laughs> there's a few vlogs um of her play basically playing around um there's more pictures that I need to put into another flippogram because what I'm doing is I'm taking pictures of her daily and I'm gonna end up putting them into a flippogram each day just so you guys can see how she grows um obviously flippograms are a bit weird and they're um different different because you have to change the speeds and stuff but basically 
like, comment, subscribe, and I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye!